I'm going to walk you through a simple process and automatic registration using scene 2019.2. I've already imported a scan from the SD card or a scan job from the SD card. So now I'm going to click on process scans down here in the lower left corner. I'll select the project up here at the top. Everything below will be processed. I'll then click configure processing. I'll go down my list of items, make sure that skip fully processed scans is checked, create scan point clouds is checked, colorized scans is checked, dark scan point filter is checked, uncheck the distance filter, check stray point filter and uncheck the edge artifact filter, particularly if you're working with forensic scenes outside. We're not using targets, so none of the targets will be checked off. And down here at the bottom, perform automatic registration. Top view and cloud to cloud should be selected. When I click start processing, the process and registration will begin. Once the processing and registration is complete, you will see a message telling you that everything has successfully processed, successfully saved, registered, and that it's successfully saved the registration. We'll next click on Show Registration Results. The recommended next step is to verify the registration for scans. I'll now click on Verify Registration for Scans and click Start Verification. Here I'll look at the outlines to see if the outlines of the building that I've scanned look reasonable. I'll then click on Report. And here is where I can see how well that the scans went together. I can review all of the report, part of the report. I can review the report in detail and looking at each and every scan that was compared. I can also save this report to a PDF file and I can uh, apply that to the current project I'm working on to make sure that uh, it goes in the right place. So I change the folder to the current project. And if you're wondering which project you're working on, the name of the project will be up here in the upper left corner. So simply match it here and then click save. Now your report is saved in PDF format. Now I can answer yes. I want to continue and click finish. You're now ready to continue to the explore tab or you can start working with your scans.